Hey guys, welcome to Amy's Autopsy Report. My name's Amy, and this review is going to be for the newly released film called Lights Out. This film is based on a short film, which I'm sure most of the people have seen by now, but if you haven't, just YouTube Lights Out short film, and it'll come up. It's, it's very short, it's very frightening, and it's very effective. Um, this is what the current poster looks like. you can see that or not that's kind of there it is got a light switch duct tape on there um, I went to see this on Saturday with one of my friends and um, you know I wasn't really sure what to expect it is based on a short film about when the lights are turned off, this creature, you're seeing this creature, and I'm not gonna go into a lot of the plot. I'm gonna tell you basically, you know, similar to what type of story it is and, and that kind of thing. Um, I was really expecting nothing. I do like films that James Wan is involved in, even some of the ones that aren't as good as The Conjuring, like Annabelle, um, you know, I know a lot of people really hated that film. I didn't mind it. I didn't think it was great, but I thought it was enjoyable. Um, I also, you know, that other one, Dead Silence with the puppet, the puppet was very effective. It just felt like the rest of the story didn't, you know, pan out as good as it could have been, but I didn't mind that movie either, and I know a lot of people hated it. I didn't hate it, but I, again, it wasn't a great, great film, just kind of a fun watch or whatever. So Lights Out. Um, it is a paranormal type of story. If you've seen the short film and you like the short film, I think that you're probably going to like this because it's a, just a lot more of that. Um, I thought that, to me, it was creepy because I am sometimes afraid of the dark. I know it sounds weird, but sometimes I am afraid of the dark. Um, I thought that the, that the creature was very effective. It was kind of like they showed enough but not too much and I just felt like it was I felt like that was effective it is a paranormal story like I said it's definitely a jump scare movie um, so if you're not into that sometimes I don't like jump scare movies because I think it's just cheap when they could build atmosphere and stuff but I, I really I really thought that this did a good job of both but it is full of jump scares um, Let's see, things I didn't like about the film. Oh, another really great part about the film was the ending. I did not expect the ending, and it was good. I thought that the ending was well done. I was concerned, like I said, I was concerned about this film because it is based on a short film, and I didn't want to see, you know, sometimes when something is a short film and they stretch it out to be a feature film, you lose a lot of it, and it ends up not being good at all. Um, I thought it was a fun watch, you know. Um, my, one of my friends that I went with, you know, they liked it too. Um, so, you know, things I didn't like about the film. Um, there were a couple of cheesy moments here and there. Um, nothing over the top. Uh, I thought that, you know, most of the acting was, was okay. Some of the acting was a little bit predictable and a little bit mediocre, but, you know, these were all unknown people, at least to me. Um, and, you know, there's not really much else I didn't like about it. It was, it was a little bit predictable. Um, but like I said, I thought the ending was pretty good and I was concerned at how they were going to end it. Um, and, uh, but, but yeah, it w it was kind of a fun summertime watch. You know, we're not talking about a horror masterpiece here, just kind of a fun paranormal flick. Um, I thought it was enjoyable. I went to see it at matinee price, so that was cheap. It was cheaper. Um, I'm going to give this movie a three out of five. I think if you like paranormal jump scare type movies, I think you're probably going to think this is a fun one. Um, again, not a horror masterpiece, um, but definitely kind of a fun popcorn flick, you know, midnight movie type of thing. Um, I enjoyed it and, uh, that's it. Three out of five. I say, check it out. If you're into that kind of movie, if you're not, I would avoid it. You're not going to like it. If you hated the short film, you're not going to like it because it's a lot more of that. Um, that's it. Three out of five. Check it out. 
Um, thanks to everyone who has subscribed recently. Uh, welcome to the channel and like, comment, and subscribe this vi to, to the channel. <laughs> like and comment. And uh, that's it. I will catch you in the next video.